Have you ever wondered if the line between fact and fiction is as clear-cut as we believe? Late one night, lost in the labyrinthine alleys of conspiracy forums, I stumbled upon the bizarre tale of the Philadelphia Experiment. It's a story that promises everything. Secret government experiments, invisible ships, and time travel. But is it just a tale spun by imaginative minds, or could there be a sliver of truth lurking beneath the surface? Let's dive into this enigmatic episode of naval history and explore whether the Philadelphia Experiment is fact, fiction, or a cunning cover-up. The story begins in the early 1940s, during the throes of World War II. Allegedly, the United States Navy conducted a series of top-secret experiments at the Philadelphia Naval Shipyard. The goal? To render the USS Eldridge a naval destroyer escort invisible to radar. This covert project, often linked to the esoteric theories of Albert Einstein's unified field theory, supposedly culminated on October 28, 1943. According to legend, the ship not only became invisible, but also teleported from Philadelphia to Norfolk, Virginia, and back again, leaving behind a trail of incredulous witnesses and horrific accounts of sailors fused into the ship's hull. The first whispers of this incredible event surfaced decades later, with a man named Carlos Miguel Allende, or Carl Allen, being one of the primary sources. In a series of letters sent to author and UFO researcher Morris K. Jessup in 1955, Allende detailed the experiment, claiming to have witnessed the Eldridge's disappearance firsthand. Jessup, already intrigued by the mysteries of the universe, found himself drawn into this vortex of conspiracy and speculation. The letters described not only the ship's invisibility, but also the devastating effects on its crew, who reportedly suffered from severe psychological trauma and disfigurement. Central to the story is the alleged use of Einstein's unified field theory, a theoretical framework attempting to merge electromagnetism and gravity into a single coherent force. While Einstein himself was rumored to be involved in various secret projects during World War II, there is no concrete evidence linking him to the Philadelphia experiment. The very notion of using such advanced physics to render an object invisible or teleported across vast distances sounds like the stuff of science fiction. Yet, it is this intersection of cutting-edge science and fantastical possibility that keeps the legend alive and endlessly fascinating. As the legend goes, when the USS Eldridge reappeared in Philadelphia, chaos ensued. Some crew members were reportedly found embedded in the metal structures of the ship, while others went insane or vanished entirely. These horrifying outcomes add a layer of macabre intrigue to the story, suggesting that tampering with the fabric of reality can have dire consequences. The Navy, however, has consistently denied that any such experiment took place, attributing the tale to misinterpretations and fabrications. Official records indicate that the Eldridge was in Brooklyn on the alleged date of the experiment, far from the Philadelphia Naval Shipyard. Despite official denials, skepticism persists. The Navy's response has been predictably dismissive, with documents and timelines meticulously discrediting any claims of teleportation or invisibility. Skeptics argue that the Philadelphia experiment is nothing more than an elaborate hoax or a misinterpretation of routine naval experiments with degaussing technology aimed at making ships less detectable to magnetic mines. Yet, the fervent denials only seem to add fuel to the fire for conspiracy theorists who believe that the government has a vested interest in keeping such groundbreaking technologies under wraps. Alternative theories abound, 
ranging from plausible scientific hypotheses to wild conjecture. Some suggest that the experiment might have involved advanced cloaking technology rather than literal invisibility. Others propose that the tales of teleportation and time travel are exaggerated accounts of more mundane occurrences, distorted over time by miscommunication and sensationalism. However, the most intriguing explanations often delve into the paranormal, positing that the experiment opened a portal to another dimension or that extraterrestrial technology was involved. Such theories keep the story in the realm of the extraordinary, perpetuating its mythic status. Morris K. Jessup and Carlos Miguel Allende are pivotal figures in this saga. Jessup, an astronomer and author deeply engrossed in the mysteries of the cosmos, became the inadvertent chronicler of the Philadelphia experiment through his correspondence with Allende. Allende's letters, filled with intricate details and speculative science, painted a vivid picture of the experiment's alleged outcomes. Jessup's subsequent investigation and publication of these letters in his book, The Case for the UFO, introduced the wider public to the possibility that our government was dabbling in technologies far beyond the known limits of science. Their exchanges form the backbone of much of the lore surrounding the experiment. The influence of the Philadelphia experiment extends far beyond the confines of military history, permeating popular culture and media. It has inspired countless books, movies, and television shows, each adding new layers of intrigue and speculation. From the 1984 film, The Philadelphia Experiment, to episodes of The X-Files and Fringe, the story has been reimagined in various forms, reinforcing its status as a cultural touchstone. These fictional portrayals, while often dramatized, keep the legend alive in the public imagination, blurring the lines between reality and fantasy. Eyewitness accounts, though varied and often inconsistent, add a compelling human element to the story. Those who claim to have seen the USS Eldridge vanish or reappear describe the event with a mix of awe and terror. However, the credibility of these witnesses is frequently called into question. Many accounts emerged years after the fact, and details often contradict one another. Yet, the persistence of these stories suggests that something out of the ordinary might have occurred, even if the exact nature of the event remains shrouded in mystery. It's this blend of anecdotal evidence and unanswered questions that keeps the debate alive. Science offers tantalizing possibilities that might explain the stories surrounding the Philadelphia experiment. The concept of invisibility and time travel touches upon cutting-edge fields like quantum physics and relativistic mechanics. While current science cannot account for the dramatic claims of teleportation or merging humans with metal, theoretical advances in quantum entanglement and space-time manipulation suggest that our understanding of reality is still in its infancy. The very notion that the fabric of space and time could be bent or altered fuels speculation and underscores the extraordinary potential of future scientific breakthroughs. Conspiracy theories surrounding the Philadelphia experiment are as plentiful as they are diverse. Some argue that the experiment was a deliberate attempt by the government to develop a superweapon during World War II, while others believe it was an accidental discovery of time travel capabilities that needed to be kept secret at all costs. The notion of government secrecy adds a layer of credibility for some, as many real-life projects, like the Manhattan Project, remained hidden from the public for years. The idea that there might be undisclosed technologies or knowledge guarded by powerful entities is a recurring theme in conspiracy circles, adding depth to the narrative.
Modern investigations into the Philadelphia experiment continue to yield new insights and revelations. While many of these investigations debunk the more fantastical elements, they also uncover intriguing historical details that add nuance to the story. For example, research into naval records and ship logs often reveals discrepancies and anomalies that fuel further speculation. These modern sleuths, armed with contemporary technology and analytical methods, bring fresh perspectives to the age-old mystery, suggesting that while the legend may be embellished, there might still be grains of truth hidden within. The psychological and social impact of the Philadelphia experiment cannot be underestimated. The story taps into deep-seated fears and fascinations, from the ethics of scientific experimentation to the boundaries of human understanding. It raises questions about the lengths to which authorities might go to achieve military superiority and the potential consequences of tampering with forces beyond our control. This psychological intrigue keeps the story relevant, prompting ongoing discussions and debates among enthusiasts and skeptics alike. The legend serves as a cautionary tale about the hubris of man and the potential perils of scientific overreach. In conclusion, the Philadelphia experiment remains an enigmatic and polarizing topic. Whether it is seen as a fantastical myth, a misunderstood scientific endeavor, or a deliberate government cover-up, its legacy endures. The story's enduring appeal lies in its ability to straddle the realms of possibility and imagination, prompting us to question what we know and what might still be hidden from view. As long as there are questions about the boundaries of science and the extent of governmental secrecy, the Philadelphia Experiment will continue to captivate and confound, inviting us to ponder the mysteries that lie just beyond our grasp. Thank you for joining me on this deep dive into one of history's most tantalizing tales. Until next time, keep questioning, keep exploring, and never stop seeking the truth. Goodbye.